Well, that was easier than expected. I mean, I kind of came into this division thinking, yeah, I'll try not and embarrass myself too much, but yeah, that was far too easy. I mean, the whole first season in Division 1, undefeated, 7 wins, 1 draw. It's a pretty good return for a first crack at Division 1, I would say. Yep, definitely a season of highs, like the first game in Division 1. Just got to keep calm. Oh! Open them up, and he takes the shot. Left the defense, and the shot's off. The big wins that followed, and of course, the last game of the season. So yeah, I guess the only way to go from here is... down. Well, that's slightly concerning. But anyway, since this season went so well, and knowing my luck, I probably won't have many more like it, I thought it deserved a fitting send-off. So I threw together what I thought were the top 5 goals of the season. So without any more fannying about, here they are. And starting at number 5, Blasikovsky charging down the right, whips a ball in, knocked down by Podolsky and caught by Royce, who EA seemed determined to turn into a left midfielder. Yeah. Thanks for that EA. <sighs> and at number 4 it's Tony Cruz showing off one of his many many talents by arrowing a free kick into the top corner. God damn, this fucking useful. And at number three, Lucas Podolski and Ilkay Gundogan, the two least German sounding Germans ever, combine for Gundogan to finish off with style. And at number two, building up with the back of some lovely one touch passing, they try and take out Royce, but he's not going down. He decides to beat the defender not once, but twice before arrowing it into the top corner. Another brilliant goal from Marco Royce, and they do manage to take him out, but he gets right back up again. He's clearly just unsolved. And at number one, it's Tony Cruz again with, well, do I really need to explain this? Yeah, just one of his many talents. Who the fuck needs pace when you've got Tony Cruz? And with that, sadly, this season is brought to a close. Weird that considering he was my top goal scorer, Podolski didn't feature in this list at all. But I guess that just means he scores all the shitty, sweaty goals throughout the season. But, I don't know. We'll see if he makes it in next season. That's all from me for this season, so, see you next season.